nine days left for US election. Only nine. And if you have watched President Trump talk today, it's unbelievable how he is mocking COVID. Joking, making fun, COVID, COVID, COVID. Yesterday has been the second highest day. Almost 90,000 people tested positive just in the US and globally millions of people. We're not talking numbers. These are precious people. Instead of, and then today, tests came out. The vice president, my good friend, Mike Pence, all his staff tested positive, five of them. Positive. And I'm sure he has it too. If, if all the people, five around him tested, but he doesn't want to confess if he has, or he's hiding just like Trump, I hope he's not lying. I don't want to call him liar because he's not a liar. Or he's hiding. This is unthinkable, unimaginable, beyond my imagination. What is going on? 40 million people, known cases, pandemic, around the world. Maybe unknown, three, four hundred million. India is number two. Knowing almost we have eight million, almost equal to America. And how many are not tested? If we are only testing one, two, three percent, you can imagine. If it is eight million or 80 million, ten times more. But we are praying for you. You have to do what it takes. And today's statements bothered me so much. And uh, so I can't, you know, I don't want to attack President Trump because I love him personally. I pray for him. I wish him well. But at the same time, his actions are unbelievable. No president has ever dealt with American people like that or world people like this, like President Trump is dealing. You know, I have known eight presidents, U.S. presidents, four sitting, Bill Clinton, George Bush, President Obama, and President Trump. And former presidents like Jimmy Cotton and Ronald Reagan and... Ford and Nixon. This, this is unbelievable. So sad. American presidency is mocked and laughed. He's acting more like with his actions, reckless. That's why he got it. I told on May 10th he will get it and he got it. Thank God he's healed. Thank you for praying because we don't want to wish anybody to die. We wish all people well. I wish you all well. I'm praying for you and you should pray for your neighbors, your friends, whoever you are, wherever you are. That is why this program, every, just before I started this program, I'm praying, Lord Jesus, help me, guide me. Because I have no energy. I, I will read the question, somebody asking how many hours I sleep. So let's get into questions because I promised I will read at least 10 of your comments or questions. So Leo and Natalia are going to read. Go ahead, Natalia. What are the questions for today? First question, Dr. Paul. Anthony from the US wants to know why you supported Trump in 2016 and why are you supporting Biden now? Thank you, Anthony. You've been asking this question so many times, not once. You've been my friend for 30 some years and uh, I love you, respect you. you know, your mother died, your elder brother died. I stayed in your home almost 30 years ago when I was a little boy type, you treated me all great. But let me tell you something, brother. Yes, I supported Trump in 2016, now why Biden? That's what the Holy Spirit is leading me. Based on the 10 reasons I gave in my book. That's why I tell every Indian, every American, every citizen of the world, every African must read my book. That is why I'm sending it. Download it. It's free from the website, Save America and the World from Trump.com. And send and upload it to, if you have 5,000 Facebook fans or 50,000 Facebook fans, somebody today uploading to 600,000. So share with everybody 
so that their eyes can be opened why i'm support i i supported trump it's clearly one chapter and the title is why i supported most hated person in the world because most people in the world hate trump but why i supported in 2016 and now after seeing everything he has done last 4 years crossing red line fooling trying to fool god trying to fool people lying 20000 plus times according to cnn and washington post 500 powerful republicans in america who are from trump's party supporting joe biden generals presidential candidates so but i have been leading this for more than a year since october 2nd last year when i gave letter to trump talked to him encouraged him to do this 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 and resign he didn't so you will read clearly why i supported him then and why i am exposing him and he should be defeated now 10 good reasons with biblical scriptures comparing him with king nebuchadnezzar you would love it a pustakam chadivite asal meer odalru english rangalo kodu vachestadi endukante adu chaala simple లేదా గూగుల్ ట్రాన్స్లేషన్ ట్రాన్స్లేట్ చేసుకొని చదువుకోండి ఆ బుక్ అందరికి షేర్ చేయండి ఎందుకంటే మనకు పది పేజీలు ఉన్నాయి ఫేస్బుక్ ఈ మెయిన్ పేజీలు ఇప్పుడు నేను వస్తుంది ఇంకా మర్జ్ అవ్వలేదు వివేక్ నాలుగు సంవత్సరాల నుంచి మర్జ్ చేస్తాను అంటున్నాడు ఇది మోస్ట్లీ తెలుగు పీపుల్ ఫ్యూ ల్యాక్స్ నాన్ నాన్ తెలుగు వాచింగ్ బట్ అదర్ పేజెస్లో ఎక్కువ ఇతర దేశాలు ఉన్నారు ఈ పది పేజీలు కలిస్తే మోర్ దెన్ వన్ క్రోర్ ఫార్టీ ల్యాక్స్ అనుకుంటాను అది కూడా ఫేస్బుక్ త్వరగా మర్జ్ చేసినట్టు చేయండి మీరు దీన్ని షేర్ చేయండి సో కమింగ్ బ్యాక్ టు ఇంగ్లీష్ ఇట్ ఈస్ సో ఇంపార్టెంట్ యు రీడ్ దిస్ బుక్ అండ్ షేర్ విత్ ఎవ్రీబడి నౌ అండ్ ఆఫ్టర్ ది ఎలక్షన్ బికాస్ యూ నీడ్ టు బి ఎన్లైటెడ్ సో ఎంతని యూ విల్ సపోర్ట్ మీ ఇఫ్ యూ రీడ్ ది బుక్ థ్యాంక్ యూ